seven. They were scored a 25 out of 40 on the premiere of Dancing with the Stars last Monday night. That put them in the middle of the pack. Suzanne Summers and partner Tony Dovolani put together a routine reminiscent of the 70s to the tune of Let's Get Physical by Olivia Newton-John, jazzercise outfits, and they even included the infamous Thighmaster, pitched in television commercials by Summers. I caught up with the pair last week while working on their next dance at a small studio in downtown Palm Springs. While they weren't embarrassed about the routine, they say they felt a bit out of place. First week was <laughs> first first day at school kind of thing. I'm really excited about week two. And boy, did we show up with the right outfits the first day of school. <laughs> yeah, really, really, was, you know when your mom sends you to school in a stupid outfit and you get there <laughs> and you go, none of the other kids are wearing wait, this. <laughs> no, you, you said it best. You said uh, it was like a black tie event and we didn't get the memo. Seven, eight. The duo plans to turn it up this week, dancing the jive, hoping that by updating their outfits and music, the judges will see the footwork and the hard work they are putting in. Summers meets Dovolani six days a week for at least four hours a day, going over the routine step by step. Both say it's grueling, but well worth it. It's really a much better behind shot. <laughs> what I want to do is I want to make sure that people see her inner beauty in the outer way. So we picked a really cool song we're doing jive this year i mean this week and we're really excited about it mm -hmm. and i wanted to make sure i put on something really hot and sexy on her summers is 68 years old and in phenomenal shape she attributes her good health and stamina to her diet and exercise regime which she has painstakingly researched and written about in 25 books <laughs> summers is used to taking risks and finding success but taking on dancing with the stars is a whole different deal I hike. I'm a big hiker. I know all the trails. This is um, no screwing around dancing. Well, I, we both realize I'm not going to get a free pass for being 68. <laughs> Del Villani, who is the world champion of dance, is on his 19th season with the show. He has made it to the finals three times, winning the Mirrorball Trophy in season 15. He says he doesn't compare his partners to anyone but he sure has a lot of nice things to say about current partner, Suzanne Summers. She is, comes as the most prepared person I've ever worked with. She comes ready to learn. She does her homework at home. She's, she's in a good mood all the time. I'm really enjoying this, and, um, and he's a patient teacher. And imagine how hard it is to be the world dance champion and take somebody who is not a dancer and say, we're going to dance in a week. Um, it's hard. And even though Summers is used to the pressure of being on live television, she says her nerves kicked in the night before the premiere during their practice session. But come Monday, it was a different story. On show day, the pro in me went zen. Now this is definitely <laughs> one of the greatest gigs any, any dancer could ever have. I mean, I get to work with the likes of Suzanne Summers, which I told her if there was a lineup, I would have picked her. Oh.